In recent years, studies have suggested that playing too many video games may contribute to teen depression. But now, new research shows at least one video game can actually zap a bad mood and help kids feel better about themselves. Like any typical video game, this one has good guys, bad guys, explosions, and missions. But this game is anything but typical. Through the storyline, we try to demonstrate the principles of cognitive behavioral therapy. Developed by a team of New Zealand researchers, the game called Sparks is actually being used to help combat depression in young people. Here's how it works. A mentor helps guide you through every level of the game. As you advance, you learn certain skills like anger management, conflict resolution, even breathing and relaxing techniques. So far, researchers say results have been astounding. 44% of teens who played the game regularly had their depression go into remission. I think it is... Um very much a step in the right direction. Psychiatrist Dr. Igor Galinker says computer games can provide a sense of control, even companionship, for those feeling isolated and depressed. Functions uh, like a pet, in a way. Esther Lohr, owner of the Fort Lee Gaming Center, Local Battles, isn't at all surprised at the results of the Spark study. A lot of the role-playing games, you have to make social connections, and you have to make sure your health is good, and you have to make sure that your character is able to kind of overcome these obstacles, and that's kind of life's theme. Teen gamers agreed, saying playing certainly lifts their spirits. You start to feel this... Um, Lifting feeling where you're like, oh, I'm so good. Calming and like relaxing. But Dr. Galinker warns while a game may be a great tool, it can never replace human interaction. And studies estimate roughly 80% of teenagers fighting depression never receive treatment. The hope is this game will help those teens who are too embarrassed to come forward or can't afford tr uh, traditional therapy. Okay.